Hey viewers, this is Ash and welcome to my blog. When talking about promises, we all must have heard and experienced that promises are meant to be broken. But that's not the case when talking about rail connectivity to international container transshipment terminal at Vallar Padam. Rail Vikas Nigam Limited RVNL, a special purpose vehicle that is SVP, under the Ministry of Railways was entrusted with the job of construction of rail connectivity from Idapalli to international container transshipment terminal Vallar Padam with a target to complete the rail connectivity work by 31st of March 2010. By taking the engine to the completed track on this day, that promise stands fulfilled. Therefore, a special thanks to District Administration, Cochin Port Trust, contractors, workers, media and people for their support for this project. The final cost of the project after completion is about Rs 350 crore. The total length of the rail connectivity is 8.86 km and starts from the existing Southern Railway Network at Idapalli Railway Station and runs parallel to the existing track for a length of around 3 km by constructing earthen embankment and minor bridges up to Vadudala. Then it passes over the longest bridge in India of about 4.62 km and passes through the inhabited area of Vadudala and across Idiakara Island and finally reaches Vallar Padam where a new railway station is being constructed. This line is only a dedicated line for goods traffic. This project has the longest railway bridge and other four small bridges. The bridges are on 1.2 diameter piles and are taken to an average depth of about 55 meters. By taking the engine to ICTT Vallarpadam, it announces the arrival of rail connectivity to ICTT Vallarpadam. That's all from my side. Be in touch with me through my blog ash.marinebistv.com. Catch you later with some more fresh updates. Take care and bye-bye.